Okay, we're going to jump on over to pad C3. C3 is Mr. Jay Sesler. This is a Lock Bruiser EXP, 1K550, 2I211s. At Apogee, you'll have a chute, and then you will have uh, mains. It's something or other. He didn't give you the height. 500 feet. There'll be air starting the 2I211s. Transolve timer on board, 27 pounds. Heads up flight. Sky is clear, range is clear, going in five, four, three, two, one. Rock and roll time. Engines coming. Come on, eyes. Come on, light the eyes. Main start on the eyes. There we go. Yeah. Rock and roll on. All right. Sustainer engine cut off. There we go. Right on cue. A little early on the shoots, but all together, we're not complaining. Al Gore would be absolutely proud of the pollution that we're throwing into the environment. That was sweet. And what we're going to be looking at 500 feet, the main shell deploy. I don't like the way that nose and, cone is wobbling. Soon we should be waiting for the mains on this for a perfect landing. Right about now will be nice. Come on, blow the mains. There we go. That's what is supposed to be done. Absolutely outstanding. Give that man a hand. Nice job. Okay, going over to C4, we got Mr. Dave Lukai and Mr. Terry Chiffant. This is a Amram. No, it's Amram too. It looks more like a uh, Phoenix. H124 and PML kit. Wow. Sky is clear.